Manning Insurance Services, doing business as Accessible Health Insurance, is a completely independent firm specializing in health insurance for individuals and businesses. We design plans with a focus on risk management, low costs, and tax efficiency. Contact us today for a free evaluation. Some of us gathered here last November and we talked about plans to have an artist, John Bigger, who's here today, to create a statue of Wendell Brown, everybody's dearly beloved poet. Wendell Brown is from Little Rock, Arkansas. Uh, he served in Vietnam. He was a sergeant there. And while he was there, he witnessed some rather gruesome things. He returned here to the States a little messed up, and he became homeless. And he was poor, and he lived beneath bushes, and he lived beneath bridges. He parked himself right out here in front of this building, here in Brentwood, day after day, year after year. And yet we all loved him. We adored Wendell Brown. He was so positive. He always had a good word to say. If a woman walked by, he'd say, hey, gorgeous, hey, beautiful. And if a guy walked by, he'd say, you want to buy a poem? And, and if you ever really looked at his poems carefully, they're excellent. He talked a lot about gratitude, about his love of life, about his love of Brentwood. Uh, when we leave today, I, I hope that's the lesson we all draw from this, is that if you can just shed a little light every day and sprinkle a little fairy dust, you can make somebody else's day a little bit brighter, and then they in turn will pay it forward, and good stuff will happen. I also want to thank Jonathan Bigger. Yeah. I met Jonathan a few years ago. I was a sculpture student in the studio, and it was just astounded by the talent of uh, his ability to capture someone's not only facial features, but their spirit and their humanity. And he said, wouldn't it be great if we could have somebody recreate Wendell to sit out here forever? So when we all drive by every morning, and we're expecting to see him, we will be there. He's just sitting on Wendell. Jonathan, tell us what went into the sculpture. I sculpted Wendell from the photographs that, that I've been unfortunately imported, which uh, very amusing today, I got an email from someone who said that Wendell's on the Google Maps, which you go by. But I sculpted it in clay and made rubber molds and then cast it in wax and that went into the bronze and what we have here is uh, bronze and concrete. Uh, in this sculpture, in a fragment of his chest, I sculpted the country of Vietnam and I put Wendell's birthstone in the actual city in which he was altered. There's a poem that he's writing in this culture, and it's a poem about Brentwood and the people that love him and support him. It takes people like you that are here today for this unveiling to get involved to try to solve this problem that is endemic in the city of Los Angeles right now. I'm hoping that the folks that put this together, um, thank you very much, that one day that I see maybe a book of poetry of Wendell's, maybe the community to get together and publish this, and maybe the proceeds from this book might go to help the homeless, right? What a great idea. I'll buy, I'll sign up for 10 copies now, whoever does that, so, um, so the proceeds go there. So thank you again for being here, and hopefully stay and enjoy the beautiful